Hey guys, welcome back to Harrison Hacks. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your SEMU portable. Um, I notice a lot of setup guides, they leave this part out and every time you move your SEMU build to a different drive or a different folder, then it can't find your games. I'm going to make it so you can eliminate that and uh, let's get started. So I'm using SEMU 2.0. It's the new experimental build, and I'm on Windows, so I downloaded the Windows zip file. This is not a setup guide for SEMU. There's tons of those out there. This one is basically just show you how to make it portable. So I'm going to take my zip folder, 7-zip, extract here. Now I got my SEMU. Now I only have one game. So I'm going to open up the folder, and the first thing I'm going to do is right-click, new folder, and I'm going to call it Games. just like that. And I'm going to take my game, drag it into my games folder. Now I'm going to launch SEMU. And to keep it portable, we are going to leave this field empty on the MLC01. Game path, we're going to browse. We're going to go to where our games folder is. Mine is in my SEMU games folder. I don't have to enter the folder, I just click it, select folder. I'm going to download the graphics packs. Do I want to view them? No. I'm going to click Next. Here you can configure your, your input if you want, start games full screen, so on and so forth. But that's not the purpose of this tutorial, so I'll click Close. So you can see there is my game. So I'll close, close, and I'll just go New, Folder, and let's say I'm just, I'm moving it. I'm moving it away from where it was. So now when I go to launch SEMU, my game isn't there. So to fix that, we're going to go to our settings.xml, we're going to right click, and we're going to go to edit. And we're going to scroll down right here to game paths, and the entry right now is asking us to be on the desktop. If we take everything except the word games, just like that, eliminate it, so it just says games, file, save, close. Now we'll open SEMU, there's our game. Now let me take my SEMU folder and I'll cut and put it back on my desktop without changing any settings, SEMU, the game. So I'll mute my system. There it is. It works. So just like that, now your SEMU is completely portable. And no matter where you move it, you can move it to another drive, you can move it inside of a folder that's inside of a folder that's inside of a folder. It doesn't matter. It's going to be completely portable. And I don't know about you, but that's how I prefer all my emulators to be. Everything self-contained. So that's going to do it for this one, guys. I really appreciate you watching. Please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, but most importantly, have a good day.